welcome back to our channel. So in today's video we have got a huge autumn winter boohoo haul for you. We've been collecting some stuff over the past few weeks and I feel like if you come to YouTube to find a autumn winter haul that's got coats, jackets, knitted jumpers, jumper dresses, jeans, we've literally got everything in this haul. I'm so excited to show you guys what we picked up. I feel like Boohoo is smashing the autumn winter clothing. Their stuff is so nice and we've picked up some really nice pieces. Like always we'll leave the links in the description to all the items so you can go and shop them yourself but if you do like this video make sure you give it a like and also subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Uh, without further ado let's get into the video. I've literally got three massive bags this size. That's how much stuff we've got in this haul. I don't even know where to start. Oh, we'll just start with what we're wearing. Yeah, actually. okay, let's start with what we're wearing. Yeah. So the first thing I picked up was this tracksuit. I literally love a Boohoo tracksuit. They're such good quality. I feel like Boohoo is one of the best places to get tracksuits yeah. in the winter. They're just really thick. You know, some jumpers aren't very good quality, but these have like the fleece inside and they're just such good quality. And the hoods don't fall funny. They sit yeah, like really nicely. Yeah, they're not nicely. floppy. I feel like I'm really fussy with my tracksuits. So yeah. I need like a nice hood fleece inside and Boohoo always have really nice ones. I just picked up this official studio tracksuit in this cream colour. I haven't actually got a tracksuit in this colour, probably because I'd be worried that I would ruin yeah, it. That's so nice. But how nice is this? And this bit on the jumper is actually green. I'll show you close up. Yeah, so the official studio here is actually green, which I actually really like. I've never seen a green and cream together. And these are the tracksuit bottoms. They've just got the elasticated waist. They don't actually have the tie up. I like that. Yeah, I no. like the ones without a tie. Yeah, same. These are so comfy. I'll show you up here. Oh, where's you guys? <laughs> this is what they look like. They're like the perfect length. For reference, I'm five foot four. It's like the perfect size as well. I don't know what size I actually got it in. So I got this tracksuit in a size small, which is actually quite big for a Most size. Small, like an like oversized, one. yeah, because I do like my tracksuits to be oversized. I just love this. I can't wait to wear it with like a massive coat in the winter. So I've also got a jumper on. Um, it's literally just a plain grey hoodie. Like I said, the hood's really nice. It's like really sturdy. It's like not floppy. Oh yeah, I really like this colour grey, and I like the fact it's got the matching coloured drawstrings on the hood. And it is actually really big. I feel like I could even wear this as like a jumper dress. But I love oversized hoodies. I got this in a size medium because I know I wanted it quite big. But I feel like I could have got a small because it is really big. So I reckon that they just are oversized anyway. So you can just stick to your normal size. But I do love having really, really big jumpers just to lounge in because it feels just like more cosy. But yeah, I got this one. And then I also picked it up in the cream as well because I just love cream hoodies. I really wish they had matching tracksuit bottoms to these. Mm. This is the cream one. Mine's like like more like a yellowy cream. Yeah, this is more like a white cream. So this says design studio, but you can't really see it. But I like that when yeah. it's like, it blends into the jumper. And then this one also says design studio. I just needed some new hoodies for winter. You can't go wrong with an oversized hoodie. You can literally pair them with so much. And I love getting a new tracksuit because it just feels really fresh. Because I feel like after a while, your tracksuits go quite like bobbly. Yeah, bobbly, and you just want like a new one mm. to lounge in. But yeah, they were the two hoodies I picked up. I'm gonna carry on showing you my tracksuits because Kira hasn't actually got any more to show. But I got this sage green tracksuit. So these are the joggers. They're cuffed at the bottom. And then they've got the drawstring, which are really nice. I've actually already worn these. And then I thought I'd go for something a little bit different. And this is a zip-up hoodie instead of just like a normal one like this. So then I can wear a little t-shirt underneath. And if I get too hot, I can just unzip it. But I really like the colour of this. And I love how oversized it is. You'll see on the try and clip what it looks like on another matching tracksuit which i love and then i thought i can't go wrong with a black tracksuit and i don't actually own a black tracksuit i feel like that's like the most basic one that yeah. you should have in your wardrobe got a sweater which is literally just plain black i got this in a medium and it is quite big i don't know if it's too big then i got these joggers which are actually the recycled joggers they were only like seven pounds seven eight pounds Really? which is so good yeah they've got the cuffed bottom and then again it's just plain all over can't really say much about this but just good to have in your wardrobe and then i actually thought i picked up the same one as you but this is actually different it didn't have the embroidery on so this is just a cream tracksuit bit different cream to yours as well. Yeah. I really like yours. Do you? I yeah. prefer that colour actually looking at them together. Do you? Cream joggers and then a 
cream hoodie. This has actually got some embroidery here, which says Design Studio, which is nice because it's not like too much, it's just on the sleeve. But yeah, that was my last tracksuit I picked up. Okay, so moving on to my knitted jumpers and stuff that I picked up. I actually picked up so many and I don't know how that happened. It's, I did two different orders on different months. I obviously didn't remember what I ordered from the last month, but I picked up a lot. <laughs> Guys, I think oh this is God. the nicest jumper. Like whenever it's on, we were literally like, yeah, I was like, oh my God, screaming. where did you see that? How cute is this? So I got it in this khaki colour and it just has the distressed edge at the bottom and it's got these balloon sleeve which I really like as well. So I got this in a size small to medium. This is actually from Miss Pat by the way. I really love Miss Pat. From yeah Boo. and the quality of their stuff so good. I can't wait to wear this. I'm going to wear this tomorrow when I go to London. It's such good material and it's really thick. I actually picked it up in the cream as well because I loved it that much but... They didn't have it in a size small to medium because it sold out, so I had to get the medium to large. It's only like the smallest bit bigger, yeah. but yeah, this is the cream one. How cute is this? Again, it's just got the distressed part. I'm actually obsessed. Oh, it has a little bit of a high neck, but it's not too high. No. I don't really like high neck jumpers. Guys, you need to run to Boohoo and go on to Miss Pat. It's so nice. It's literally it's so like soft. It's heavy and like, knit. Like, yeah. It's really good quality. But yeah. They were the next things I picked up. So I actually picked up two pairs of jeans. So the first pair I got are these denim cargo style jeans. So they've got the big like cargo pocket on the front. And they're kind of like a washed denim. And um, they've got like darker bits and then like a lighter bit in the middle. And they're just wide leg. And then they've obviously got the zip and then also little pockets on the back. I thought these were really nice and just like a cool pair of jeans to put with like a little top and some chunky trainers. I reckon these will be a good length as well. Obviously you'll see on the try on clip. But I got them in a size 6. I really like those ones. And then I also picked up some ripped jeans. And these were from Miss Pat. So these just look like this with the rips on the knees. I feel like these are a lot wider than the other pair. At the bottom they go out quite a lot. But these are also really nice and I love the denim. Because I feel like I'm quite fussy with the colour of denim. And it's like quite hard to find ones that look really nice. Yeah, again, these would look really nice with like a little top and some trainers. I feel like you can't go wrong with wide leg jeans in autumn, winter. But yeah, they were the two pairs of jeans I picked up. Okay, so the next thing I picked up was this knitted co-ord set. It's from Miss Pap again. I feel like I'm just obsessed with Miss Pap. Yeah. Like, I think most of my stuff's from Miss Pap. It's a knitted high-waist mini skirt. just looks like this. And then it has the elasticated waistband. And then it comes with this roll neck jumper. And it has the thumb holes. Oh, it does. Yeah, it does. <gasps> How cute is that? How do you know that? Did you remember from the... Yeah, from the picture. Oh my God. But I haven't actually tried this on yet, but I reckon it's going to be so cute. But can you imagine wearing this to like Winter Wonderland? A pair of like knee-high boots. Yeah, knee-high boots. <gasps> I'm obsessed with this. I got this in a size 8. I just think this is so nice. I can't get over this. But I just love the thumb holes, especially for winter, because you don't want your hands to be out. And yeah. I feel like when your hands are covered, it makes you warmer. I really like this. It's gonna be really cute. So I actually picked up a pair of wide leg cargo pants in white. I haven't actually opened these yet, so I don't know what they look like. Oh, they feel like really nice material. I feel like these are a bit dressier, so you could wear these with like a pair of heels and dress them up. They've got the cargo pockets all the way down the leg. These are a size six. They do look quite big around the waist. I feel like I am sometimes a four in trousers though. I couldn't picture these with like a little crop top and then some heels and a nice bag. Obviously, you can never have too many cargos. Cargos were in trend in summer and I don't see cargos ever going out of fashion. Mm. Like they're so nice. That's all I wear. I've got these washed cotton parachute pants. So these aren't actually cargos, but I feel like parachute pants are really in trend at the moment. Yeah, there's actually drawstrings on these ones, which I don't have on my other pair, which is good because you can pull the waist in. At the bottom, they also have like a drawstring that you can make it cuffed because I know that some people don't like wearing like really wide trousers, so it's nice that you can pull them in. But yeah, they're like a washed black colour. And I just think they're really cool and they're like really soft material as well and you'll see on the try on clip how they fit Yeah, I really like those. Okay guys, you're not ready for this next item. A grey blazer I've been wanting to find a grey blazer this colour for bloody ages and This is literally the perfect colour and the perfect size 
and just the perfect everything. How nice is this? Obviously you'll see on the try and clip what it looks like on. I thought it wasn't going to be exactly how I wanted because I'm quite fussy with blazers, like how they fit like around the shoulders. It's not too broad around the shoulders, it's like perfect like width. I just think this is so nice. I got it in a size 10. I like my blazers to be a little bit oversized. I'm just obsessed with this. You want it, don't you? Yeah. Now? Um, but yeah, it's just the perfect little blazer. It just has these little tortoiseshell buttons, which I don't normally like, but they're not that obvious, no. are they? I'm just obsessed. I literally couldn't wait to show you this, guys. I feel like if you want a blazer that will go with every outfit, then definitely head to Boohoo and pick this up. So for my first knitted item, I actually got this beige long cardigan i feel like i had some cardigans last year and i just wore them so much like just to throw on over any like outfit around the house because they're just so cozy and when i saw this one i was like that looks really nice it's such a heavy good quality cardigan this is actually from miss pap it's got the belt that you can do up it's just so nice i got it in a size small to medium and it's like a really nice size because it's not like really tight it's like nice and baggy if you're looking for a long knitted cardigan then definitely look on boohoo or miss pat because they have some really nice ones okay so the next thing i picked up was another knitted jumper but it's not a jumper it's a jump dress i got this from miss pat again in a size small to medium i saw this on the website and it looked really nice the way the woman was modeling it she had it with like knee-high boots like cream knee-high boots and i just thought that looked really nice so it actually comes down like this you can like fold it down and have it open or you can have it done up i probably would have it just like undone like that but it's such good quality again really thick and just feels really like cozy look it feels really soft yeah and it's got like the slit to the side so if you have like yeah. circling shorts you'll be able to see them the sleeves are really wide at oh, the yeah. bottom as well which i really like but yeah this is what it looks like this is the length of it i have actually tried this on it does fit really nicely and it's like the perfect size for me yeah cute so i picked up some jumpers I actually got this a little bit bigger so I could wear it as a jumper dress and it actually looks really nice. So it's in a size medium. It's just this cream like ladder knit v-neck jumper. It's not too heavy, it's like quite lightweight so you could just wear like even like a little unitard underneath because um, obviously it is a little bit see-through from all the holes. I thought this would look really nice with like some knee-high boots in winter. I love jumper dresses in winter. I just feel like you can't go wrong and they're really easy to style. I also picked up this little knitted ladder distressed top. It's like long sleeve and it's quite cropped but I feel like I could have got a bigger size. I wanted it to be quite big and baggy. This is quite tight. This is a small so if you want it bigger then definitely size up. This is what it looks like up close. It's got like the ladder detail. I think this is really nice and they had it in another colour as well. I thought that would look really nice with the parachute pants that was my last like knitted item this might as well be a miss pat haul <laughs> because i've literally picked up everything from miss pat this is the next thing i picked up i just thought i need to change my wardrobe from my like summery pieces my crop tops and all of that to jumper pieces because it's getting bloody cold outside especially in the evenings now but i picked up another cozy jumper um it's in like this like really fluffy material look feel it yeah, that is it's so like a, nice. What material is that? Wool. Yeah. yeah, it's like a wool material. It's got the roll neck as well. I'm not really into roll necks, but it did look really nice in the model. And I really want to try and get into it because I feel like it looks really nice with like a black leather jacket. Do you yeah. know what I mean? I just feel like sometimes I just... <laughs> <laughs> I feel like sometimes they can look cute, but sometimes they can just look a bit like... I don't what know, yeah, it's just like so high on your neck. You hate them, don't you? Yeah. Mum likes them and I feel like I really want to get into wearing them. The sleeves just look like this, so they're folded over. I got it in a size small to medium again. I like the oversized sort of looks and jumpers, so I feel like this will be a nice size. Imagine this at like Winter Wonderland with like a black leather jacket or like a yeah, coat over the top. Yeah, really cute. Yeah, really like that. And it's so soft as well. I feel like I get all my basics from Boohoo because they just do such nice tops so i picked up these long sleeve tops and they're like a ribbed material this is actually from the tool section but i thought it doesn't really matter which means that my belly is not going to be showing which in winter you don't really want your belly showing anyway because it'll get really cold so yeah i just picked up this white one and then i also picked up the black oh this is actually a tall one as well in a size six i feel like these can go with literally anything if you don't know what to wear put a pair of jeans on cargoes and then plain basic 
long sleeve top and you're good to go. But yeah, these are really nice quality. I love rib tops because that means they're not like really see through. But yeah, I've got the white and the black of those. Oh my god, Miss Pap again. I must have just done my whole order on Miss Pat. This is the next thing I picked up from Miss Pat. So it's the recycled cosy knit split leg midi dress in black. Oh, I got it in a size six, which is weird because I'm not a size six, but it looks really, stretchy, really stretchy. So yeah. maybe that's why I picked up in a size six. I feel like you can't go wrong with a black ribbed midi dress in winter because you can just style it with loads of different things and rib dresses in winter are literally perfect because it looks nice but you're still warm this one's really thick so you'll be really cozy and you won't get cold it's quite long as well i don't know if you can see you'll be able to see on the try and clip but i feel like that's a nice length for winter but yeah that's my last knitted item i picked up this cropped white shirt and this is actually from the courtney kardashian edit plain white shirt and it's got like the balloon <laughs> sleeves <laughs> Oh. It's got the balloon sleeve, which I really like. I have actually got so many white shirts, um, but I just thought this one's different because of the sleeve detail. And I feel like you could dress this up, wear it over a dress or a unitard, or obviously you could just wear it over a top and a pair of jeans. This is a nice layering piece. I got this in a size 10 because I wanted it to be oversized, not like really tight, but you'll see how it looks on the try on clip i love when you get like fresh white shirts because mm. they're just so clean but it probably won't be that clean for long no i'm sorry miss pap again <laughs> so the next item i picked up was from miss pap again shock i just picked up this recycled premium leather look blazer i got it in a size eight which i'm surprised about i thought i would have got it in a bigger size because i am size eight because i do like my blazers to be oversized which i said before but it does look quite big yeah so i reckon this is a nice size and I feel like leather look blazers probably would look a bit weird oversized. I feel like it would look like a men's Yeah, like you've just chucked on your blazer. Your boyfriend that rides a bike. A bicycle! <laughs> <laughs> a motorbike, motorbike, yeah. But yeah, this is really cute. I've always wanted to get a black leather blazer and I found this one. And it's such good quality. It just has the two pockets at the sides. And just has this black button, which I like because I don't like buttons really that aren't the same colour. I like this, I think it's cute. I saw on a website this woman was wearing like a roll neck with a black leather blazer and it looked really nice. Right, I've got two tops. <laughs> <laughs> I've got two graphic tops left to show you and then we can move on to coats, which is probably the most exciting part of the haul. <laughs> Picked up this blue one. What's it say on? Havana Motorcycles. This is actually a plus t-shirt. So it's a size 16. But that's not a size 16, I don't think. Unless it's meant to be like a fitted t-shirt. But mm. I wanted it to be like quite oversized, long, like drop shoulder. It doesn't really fit like that. But if you like the way it looks on the try and clip, then obviously it is a really nice t-shirt. Like I really like the colour of it and the whole like design. But yeah, that was the first one. And then the second one I picked up is a M Sport Racing License Oversized Printed Slogan t-shirt in charcoal and I got this in a large and I feel like it's a little bit too big like that actually looks like my dad's t-shirt do you know what I mean yeah it might look quite cool as like a t-shirt dress yeah with some like black boots but I love the design on it it's got like a motor design and I love charcoal grey tops they were the two graphic tops I picked up right should we move on to coats yeah this is the most exciting part of the whole we both picked up the same jacket. Oh my god, look at this jacket, guys. It's unbloody believable. It's unbloody <laughs> believable. Amy got hers in a size 8, and I got mine in a size 6. Because I wanted to be like quite oversized, but when I tell you these jackets are so oversized, mm. like just stick to your normal size because. I wish I just got a six now because they're just so big. But yeah, this is the Borg Buckle Detail Cropped Aviator Jacket. I feel like aviator jackets are back in fashion like this winter. And I just love the like contrast between the black and the fluffy Borg material. It's but I feel so like nice. if you don't like oversized jackets and you're a size six, eight, then don't get this because it is really oversized. It is really big. You'll see on the try on clip. I feel like it needs to get some like wear into it because it's a bit like stiff at yeah, the moment. Yeah, it's like really like rigid. Yeah, and when you wear it. I like the fact it's cropped as well. Yeah. It doesn't hide your whole outfit. But yeah, literally obsessed with this jacket. Like we were so excited to show you guys. Okay, so the next item I picked up, it literally looks like a blanket. It's that fluffy. It's so fluffy, I'm gonna die. 
<laughs> so this is the two-tone color block teddy coat you can't go wrong with a teddy coat in winter i feel like i've got so many of these in the garage all different colors I didn't really need to pick this one up, but I saw this one and it's got like a little different two yeah, tones. Two tone. And it's so nice and it's just so fluffy and it fits really nicely. I got it in a size six. Actually, I can show you. I can show you. <gasps> Hang on, let me put it on. Guys, look at me. I look <laughs> smug as a rug. No. It's no good to bug in a rug. Oh, is that wrong? Smug as a rug. No, that's not it, snug is it? As a bug. Smug as a bug in a rug. This is how long it is. But it is really long. Yeah, it is. I feel like when you have chunky trainers on, or, yeah, like it'll be like a boots. nice length. I feel like I'm going to be wearing this to Winter Wonderland. It's just such good quality. It's just got the pockets. <gasps> I love it. So cute. So I've been wanting a trench coat now for a while. And when I saw this one, I was like, that looks like the perfect trench coat. It's like in this mocha colour. I feel like this will go with quite a lot. Like you could pair it with like black, white, cream, khaki, grey. This is actually from Miss Pat. Sorry guys, the camera just died and Kira's still eating <laughs> knickknacks. But yeah, I was talking about this trench coat. I like the fact that it's got like this double layer here. Um, it is really long, so I think it goes all the way down like near to my ankles. I think trench coats just look really classy mm. and like they dress an outfit up so you can definitely wear this to dinner. It's a really nice like smarter coat to have in your wardrobe. You definitely don't need to size up with this though because I got this in a six and it does say it's oversized so it is really big. I haven't even seen what the, oh they're oh. like tortoiseshell buttons which is really nice and matches the mocha colour. Okay, so my last clothing item is in this Miss Pat box. <laughs> so I picked up some boots. How unreal are these? I've never seen the teddy bear detail on a black boot before. So I saw these and I was like, they're so cute. Can you imagine these with a fluffy cream coat on? I envision this, but they're two different colours. I feel like I need to find a coat that's like this colour because yeah. that would be cute. I tried them on and they're a little bit too big. I picked up a size six because I'm like around a five and a half and yeah they're too big. So if you're a half size, size down. Yeah. I'm gonna have to pick them up in a size five because I think these are really cute. They're just plain black, little detail at the top. I just think they're really nice. And then the last thing I just picked up, I'll quickly show you. I've got these gold hoops. I just really like hoops at the moment. They do loads on Boohoo and these ones are just all different size small gold hoops. You've got the small size, the medium size and the large. So I really like them. And I've got like three piercings. So imagine, oh, actually that would no. be too much. <laughs> Why no, do I mean you that? Just You're done. <laughs> You're, You're done. But like, imagine like one pair of these small ones with like little studs yeah. up my, that's where I was going. I didn't mean that. Yeah, you definitely did. Definitely did. But yeah, definitely head to Boohoo and find some nice jewellery pieces on there. Right, my last item is this black leather jacket. I have a black leather jacket from Boohoo and I wear it so much and everyone always asks where it's from. And I think because it's like cropped and it's not just like your normal leather jacket. It hasn't got all like the zips and everything. But this one is quite similar. However, it does have like the belt that goes round and it has fluff inside. I didn't realise, but I've only just realised now, obviously I can wear this in winter, but then like in spring when it starts getting a bit warmer, you can literally take the fur out. That is so cool. I think that is so good. I got this in a size 10. I do kind of wish I got an 8 or a 6 because I feel like this already comes up quite oversized so it is really really big it might be a little bit too big but i'll try it on in the try on clip i feel like with a hoodie underneath it'll be okay mm. you need it to be bigger so it actually doesn't feel like really like tight and bulky but yeah got this leather jacket and it's actually unreal oh my god what i nearly forgot about my slippers <gasps> i've actually been wearing these and had these for a few weeks now and you literally live in them. I literally live in them. They're mm. so nice. When I first got them, I was like, oh no, they're a bit small because I like them being like a bit bigger. But where I've worn them, it's like stretched them. So they're literally so comfy. You know when you wear them in? So mm. now they're like moulded to my feet and they're just so nice. But look, they've got little smiley faces on and they had loads of different colours of these. I just love them. I think these were a size small. But yeah, couldn't forget to show you guys these because I live in them. But yeah, that is sadly the end of our autumn winter boohoo haul. But I'm sure we'll have many more coming for you because we just love shopping on boohoo and I feel like they bring out new pieces like every week. 
so we'll probably be buying more winter coats from there and track suits as always we'll leave the links in the description so you guys can shop any of these pieces if you like any of them remember to like this video if you enjoyed and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already thank you guys for watching and we'll see you in our next video bye <laughs>